Well, guys, I am halfway through my trip and I thought I have to tell you that this is one of the best cities that I've ever visited. I am floored by how beautiful this place is and let's start the video now. What's up fellow citizens of the world? Jordan Patrick here and welcome to my channel. So another day in the south of France and today I thought I would do a day trip to Nîmes. Now this is also located in the Occitan region in the south of France and it's only about 50 kilometers, 30 miles from Montpellier. So it's great for a day trip and this city is most known as an outpost for the Roman Empire. Now the first thing on our list is probably one of the most iconic, the Arena of Nîmes, which dates back to 70 AD. I can't wait, gotta run to go catch my train, so on y va, c'est parti! Okay, so my train number was 4651. I didn't know that the last number can change because on the screen I only saw 4650, but it's the same train, so that's good to know in advance. Um, this is the first time I've ever seen that actually. with a guide in French or to have an audio guide so I have that was super cool. I could probably do a whole video just on this amphitheater. Um, really, really incredible views. The audio guide was great. It was free, like with the entry. So um, yeah, you could do the whole French tour thing if you want, but the audio book is great as well, or the audio guide. So yeah, on to the next one. So the ticket that I got is for all three of the different monuments, um, but I have to be quick because I'm only here until 3 p.m. So I gotta get going to the next. So that video was pretty cool. So it lasts for about 25 minutes and then uh, there's a line that lasts as long as the movie. So it's like a little theater and uh, it talks about the history of Neem and these monuments. So it's pretty cool. I recommend it. Um, but just be aware that there might be a bit of a wait. You have to make sure you have a good 50 minutes and uh, yeah, it was, uh, it was nice. Okay, so the last thing on our list um, as to monuments is the Temple of Diana. Okay, so that's what I originally thought, but it's actually Tour Magne. That's the third on the list, but we're gonna visit Temple of Diana in the meantime, and then I will correct myself. Um, so we're gonna go there now. It's the last on the list. It's about noon, so I only have a few more hours to be here. So nonstop, let's go, baby.
I am not kidding when I say that this is one of the most beautiful cities that I've ever seen. And that means a lot, um, especially after living in Paris. Like, that's probably always going to be my favorite city. But, wow, this place is gorgeous. Like, I highly recommend it. I'm so tall, I can almost touch the ceiling with my head. I'm looking for the tower where you can see over the whole city. And that's when he realized he fucked up. I thought it was here, I guess not. Uh, we're gonna have to find this bad boy. So, I was wrong. This was a nice little temple at this uh, really nice, like almost like a sanctuary park. Um, but the tower is Tuo Mania. So that's where we're going to next. That is the third spot that we need to see that I have a ticket for. And uh, okay, so we're going there next. Oh, it is quite the hike up. I feel like I'm getting close, but wow, well, I'm trying to find like the quickest way, but it's a lot of like zigzag to go up the mountain. There she is. Whew, I'm sweaty. I'm hot. This mask doesn't help. Okay, so this little number 68 is my number in line to go up the tower. So, <laughs> technically, like, you do need to have some time to do this trip. Um, I would maybe recommend spending like a full weekend here just so that you're not stressed on time. I tried to haggle the guy and say like, hey, I'm, you know, I'm visiting by myself. Um, is there any way I could go up a little bit faster? I have a train at three, but uh, no chance. <laughs> but uh, he said it's about like a 25 minute wait. So that's uh, pretty much how much everything has been so far. There was this family that I just cannot avoid. It's like everywhere I went, they were like right in front of me. And it's like, <laughs> I went completely different ways. I tried to avoid them. And I like just can't get the hell away. I even like when I left, I like went a totally different opposite direction. And then it's like, oh, I turned the corner. There they are. It's like <laughs> so freaking annoying. This whole day trip, it only cost me 26 euros, which includes the 13 euro train ticket and then the 13 euros to do the three monuments. So that's a great deal if you ask me. Woohoo, so far it's an empty train, so I feel fine talking out loud. Ah, this is the life. <laughs> 